Hello and welcome to Stranded in High Pixel Skyblock. It's been a little while since we made a video, but uh, when you're not playing Skyblock, you're still progressing. So uh, what I've done uh, in between, right? I, I I saw a video that said glass prevents like mobs spawning on your stuff, so I turned all my my base into glass over there. Uh, I also moved all the minions to the max. Uh, the max size of the island just to get them out of the way for the most part. I don't know if this was in the last video or not, but uh, I then I did some crafting. I crafted a few super compactors from uh, this. It took, you know, it's been a month or two, maybe three uh, since I played. So I have some super compactors here making cobblestone, which then you see here we have a bunch in our inventory now from uh, just collecting these guys here this just a few minutes ago and uh, what we're going to do today is uh, kind of progress and we got a flint so we can make arrows I got some goals I want to do I want to get a cow minion up and going I want to get a string minion up and going a uh, spider a minion it is uh, I want to get uh, a personal compactor made so let's go ahead and do that one right now so recipe uh, personal all right, so we can make the first one, this one right here. So this requires a super compactor and some redstone blocks. So let's go ahead and make a, a super compactor. It looks like we have enough uh, enchanted cobblestone at the moment. So we got our super compactor, go back. Now we can make our personal compactor 4,000. There we go, let's go back. Let's go see if we can go ahead and make the personal compactor uh, 5,000, which gives us three slots, and we did. All right, what do we need to make the next personal compactor 6,000, I guess? I think it's this one. All right, we have the personal compactor. We just need 28 enchanted redstone blocks. Let's see how many we can make. <laughs> all right, we got 20 uh, from all that. And, uh, well, we got some... Oh, that was just Sky Handy telling me I could do some more stuff. All right, so let's go back here. Where did it go? This one, right? All right, we are three, <laughs> three away. Let's go here. Let's see if we can make some more of this. And uh, try it again. So we're missing some more of that. Let's look in our uh, ender chest here, see what we got going on. Uh, yeah, we got some, we still got a bunch of redstone, so let's do this, let's, uh, so I was just throwing, like, I was logging on every few weeks to clear out these guys, uh, so what I did is I just threw stuff in boxes, threw it in my inventory, because I was just like, you know what, I don't care, get it all out of my, uh, inventory, so we might be able to get something out of this, get that, what we got here, we got two more there, jeez, it's just, like, showing up everywhere. And I think that's that's all of that, right? Yep. Now that's gone. We used all that. All right. So we do slash craft, and we can do enchanted redstone, and then we just pop this uh, blocks of redstone in here. Let's see what we can get out of that. All right, we're twenty five blocks. <laughs> we needed twenty seven, right? Uh, let's check these cobblestone minions, make sure I didn't, like, forget to loot one of them. Because I, uh, I have not been... I've not been looting them completely because the boxes fill up and your inventory fills up, right? So, but that's just not enough to do anything. So let's just clear this out real quick. Alright, we'll make the, uh, personal three, uh, 6,000, I think it is. Uh, this is a 3,000. Or 5,000, so we'll do that next time, I guess. Alright, let's pop that back in there, and uh, let's just save all this for later. I do not have the uh, enchanted <laughs> bags, so I can't put anything in there. Alright, so that's like, I, I looted all these minions, and I was like, oh, I should be recording this, and then I came over here. So, I put a super compactor in my fishing minion here, so he would not get filled up in like 20 minutes. Xeri's quite full. Uh, which gave us some leveling up here. Our silverfish is 82 now. Our raw salmon is uh, getting good and pretty good there. So let's see. Your oak is next. 
Now I have oak and uh, birch, right? Birch will give me uh, the sack for trees, and then uh, oak will give me more storage. So I got them going to go in as we go. Then we got the coal guy here. Like, I don't know. Uh, without iron, coal is kind of useless in my opinion uh, at the moment because we just don't have uh, what it takes to make uh, everything we need for uh, like uh, long-term fuel. Sorry, I lost my voice there for a second. All right, let's go back to crafting and let's get this enchanted uh, coal just so we can clear out our bag here. All right, then we have we have these endermen. I now I was like hard. It was hard to decide what I was gonna put here, and uh, I went with endermen because I want to make an aspect of the end so I can teleport, and uh, it's a slightly better weapon than everything. So I'm gonna clear these guys out. Now the problem with these is like they, they only stack. There we got them all in one. You have to clear out your sack. They only stack to. 16, so that's a little bit of annoying when it comes to uh, some of that stuff. Zombie minion. Uh, now I have the zombie minion down because we need a lot of enchanted rotten flesh. It's just gonna take a long time to get. I think it's like 20,000 enchanted flesh, and apparently I already put a spider minion down. I didn't even remember that. That is, uh, that is crazy, right? Let me get out of the door here. I think we can upgrade this and minion so uh do we have a combat sack yeah we do so we go to combat sack let's get all this silk out and uh, see if we can upgrade this i guess i did that last time i logged on that's perfect that's one less thing we got to do uh we need string to make the larger enchanted sacks so that's kind of thought process there because i'm not going to be able to kill enough uh, spiders to do anything with that at the moment. You can see here, we still got this set up, but we need to get iron, uh, and we need to get gold. So those are kind of like our next items we're going to work on. Let me dump all this junk somewhere. Yeah, just jump it in there. Uh, figure out later when we have sacks to actually uh, deal with it. So let's open that up. Uh, let's put that in there. And we'll just keep the crystal compactor there for now. You can see here, my bags are just like absolutely full of stuff. And until we have uh, some other things going, it's going to take a little while. So, uh, let's see where we need to go. So, we don't have any buffs. We don't have anything going on. I think, what what armor are we wearing? So, where is my armor set that I was using? Squire? I was using Starlight and Squire, I think. There we go. I think it should give us combat, right? Uh, what I need to do is go over here and clear this out, and, uh, we can, I guess, do something with it. Jeez. Am I using the right weapon? I mean, what the hell are these things? 3,000 hit points. Jeez. All right. 2,300. Yeah, so I guess our combat level got all upgraded a little bit here. Because we are not at the 6,200, uh... Enderman right there. All right, let's just knock them off because that'll just straight up kill them. Because we're gonna turn the, the we're gonna turn this back into the uh, the nether, uh, so that we can actually uh, do some stuff. But I want to get. Do I have a shovel? Please tell me I have a shovel, right? There's a diamond shovel. All right. I want to clear this out because this was causing me all kinds of what? The? Causing me all kinds of heartache, and I was trying to. But I was trying to actually farm this, and that, this is one of the reasons I turned everything into glass over there. Because uh, nothing spawns on it, one. And uh, two, it is, uh, doesn't burn. So, I'm just going to get rid of all this. I don't know what I was thinking when I built this, but uh, it's not going to work very well. So we're just going to get rid of it. If anything, it was making it harder to kill things. <laughs> it was making it easier to kill things. Uh, but we'll save all this dirt. Uh, I think I have a, a use for it. Yeah, I made this nice little walkway here. Uh, now, instead of glass, you can use, uh, what is it, uh, slabs? But I don't I don't like the way slabs looks, and it just wasn't going to work out for me. 
All right, let's get this uh, just kind of going down here. Can we? Yeah, there we go. We can do three at a time. Go this way. <laughs> Uh, this is one of the things I hate is like uh, sometimes you break a block too fast and it ghosts or something. I don't know. It's like real Minecraft does it, but I like, don't know how to fix it without like jumping around it. It's so weird. Go. And then. <laughs> You can see, see these Endermen, that one's only 1,300 hit points, but uh, like, I killed one that was really strong. I think it was like 9,000 hit points, but I had to use like the little cover thing I got going over there. It was crazy. I have not been focusing too much on combat because from what I understand, the higher I get my combat, the more higher the higher level the mobs are. And we're going to get to the point where I can't even kill anything, honestly, with... Uh, current weapons, so it's just kind of one of those. Make sure we're not doing some stupid things. Uh, come on, really? Oh, this is retarded. There we go. All right, we're going to leave one, one wall just because of that, right? <laughs> uh, so when they try to knock us off, we just can get knocked back to that. I think that'll make it safe. Now, I did see, uh, I think I saw a video on, like, stacking the minion, the combat minions on top of each other, and then having them create, like, a, like, a column, if you will, of the minions to be able to spawn them quickly, to be able to kill them for, like, Slayer stuff, so that's something we'll probably end up doing sooner or later. But uh, right now, we <laughs> my goal is to turn this into the nether and finish gold. Get a gold minion down, and then uh, we see if we can upgrade anything else. Let's get a few more minion slots. Uh, I want a cow minion down. I'll take up a, like a redstone one or something if I have to. Uh, but that is kind of like where we need to be to be able to progress. So I can, you know, save time. Uh, like, like everything is about saving time and making things easier. And that's what the sacks are going to do. By having uh, all the sacks that we can get for the enchanted stuff. Like, then I can just loot everything from the minions without having to spend five minutes crafting. And that'll, that should speed things up for uh, getting things progressing a little bit better. But we'll see how this goes. Now, I probably could leave this wall, but I don't know. I'm... I'm... I feel like I just need to get rid of anything that would stop me from being able to hit the ghast uh, that, that will spawn, and that's why we have the flint minion down over there. I I should have, like, uh, a sack full of flint at this point, plus uh, a bunch of enchanted, so it's gonna be nice there. So let's, uh, let's go get some arrows and turn this back into the nether. So what we're going to do, I believe I gave my stick to, uh, uh, what is his name? Jerry. So I think you just go over here, right? And island properties, island time, change the biome. Yeah, so I gave it to him. So I have to go to talk to him now to change it. So we'll do that here in a moment. All right, let's get all this crap out of our bags. We don't need tools on us. All right, that's good. We do have our squire sword. Is that better than our mercenary sword here? Ah, uh, they're about the same, I guess. 50 damage, 70 damage, plus I think I have more in chance on there. Uh, let's see, that's looking good. All right, let's get everything we need here. Just saw something in my bag. I wasn't sure what it was. I guess it was this. No, it was this right here. Okay, a normal compactor. All right. So we're good there. We got that. Let's get uh, flint. Do we have flint on us? Because we need to make some arrows. Is a mining sack, right? All right, we have zero flint. Let's go collect that flint. I've been letting it uh, sit. 
But I can turn all the rest of it into enchanted flint because it was just like taking too much of my space. Uh, but Stranded is definitely a interesting game mode. Uh, I know we're not fishing, and that's probably what we need to be doing uh, to progress some more stuff, but ideally I think I want to try to progress uh, this path, get the gold, and then see where we go from there. All right, now we have a bunch of flint, and I think we have to manually make the arrows. We can't use the super craft stuff because they're... Uh, they're uh, a vanilla recipe for some reason. You can't use them. So, let's see. Do we have sticks? Because that would be dumb if we don't. Right, let's look here. Sacks. Alright, large mining sack. Let's get uh, one, two, three, four stacks of that. Do I have a husband? Yes, I do. And then let's get four stacks of arrows. And let's do oak. Oh, we can't do four stacks of oak, but I don't think we need that many stacks of oak. Let's just get what we can. I don't know the ratio here. All right, let's turn this into planks, which turns uh, these into sticks. And then uh, we want arrows, because we gotta click them like that. Alright, wow, we're ending up uh, with way more arrows than I thought we would. That's perfect. Sacks. Put all that back in there. Now, do we have a quiver? <laughs> I don't know if we have a quiver yet. Uh, what is the uh, command for quiver, right? It's bags, quiver. Yes, we do! Perfect. Alright, we can throw all those arrows in there so we don't have to deal with those. Now we go over here. I made a bow. Artisan short bow, perfect, right there. That has infinite quiver, which gives us a 15% chance to uh, save arrows, right? It's the only enchant I put on there. Uh, but it's a short bow, so it instantly shoots arrows. So it's, re it's really nice there. Let's get this uh, garden crap out of our bag. And I don't think I have any healing items at this point in time, from what I remember now. All right, let's talk to Jerry. Let's turn this island into the nether. Now, our goal is to kill nether pigs, ghasts, and anything else we see. You can kind of see it's already started. <laughs> so let's get up here. Uh, we shouldn't have to worry about anything, like, terrible, but... You know, this is just how it is. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's have to fight this guy right here. I don't see any pigs yet, but hopefully we get some here in a second. Now, so these Endermen, they have so many hit points. Uh, Z-Bots, right? I'm just gonna kind of, there we go. Got one of those. Now, in theory, we should auto pick up, like, if we get gas tiers and stuff. We should auto get those. Now, the, some of these spiders that spawn now are crazy strong. Alright, he's just not one to play. Oh, where'd he go? Right up here. Come on. Got it. As you can see, I'm not seeing any pigmen yet. Lots of villagers, and that's kind of like where we want to go with this. Like, I've been... I've been messing around too long, and I have not cured a villager yet, so that's kind of like... <laughs> gonna hurt us long term from progressing. Right, crypt ghouls are spawning now. Oh, this is crazy. He's aggressive. Wow. Come on. Is that gassed? I just don't see any pigmen. 
there. Let's just use the arrows. I can make more, so it's not a big deal, but... Where is this guy? There's a Pikmin right there. Alright, perfect. Alright, we got two gold nuggets. <laughs> uh, we got... I don't know how many it is we need, but... It's gonna be tedious to get to there. These are hard to hit. Come on. Let me hit you. Alright, I'm not... I'll always see more arrows than that guy down there. There's a lower HP one there. Oh, that guy fell off, I guess. Oh yeah, 13,000? What? And you can see there, he like almost kills me in one shot. Now, these ones, the 13,000 ones, I believe have a chance to drop Ender Armor. Uh, like, uh, stuff you find in the, in the normal Skyblock. So we might get a nice piece of that, which would be a significant upgrade. If we can get an accessory item, or we can get, uh, that, but <laughs> nothing. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, let's see here. Let's get this guy. Now, I'm sure there's a way I could probably, like, rig this in my favor, but... I'm terrible at this game, so... Whoa, whoa, yeah, wait, 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 what is this? Like... What are they spawning over here for? Like, this doesn't make sense. I have no blocks on me, do I? I can't use it while I'm coming. Let me grab some blocks real quick. Uh, I know. I think I made that jump, so I couldn't do that jump. <laughs> it was one of those... Uh, I was trying to get away from mobs or something like that, so I broke it. Oh, good. There's one right there. Perfect. Where's he at? I don't know why they're spawning over there, not over there. There's got to be something I'm doing wrong though, with that. There we go. Alright, we got a blaze rod that guy down, or a blaze. Here's one of these. Alright, we got gas collection four. Wow. Does that mean we're getting, like, uh... Gas tears? We are. We got 11 gas tiers. Nice. All right. So over here, we're not getting anything useful. Over there, we are. What is going on with that? I'm just... There's like, there's got to be some kind of rule set or something. They only spawn on certain blocks or something. I know later on, you have to like do certain blocks for certain things to spawn. There we go. There's a blaze. These ones here, I don't believe, drop any armor. The, the 6,000 hit point ones, but... They drop ender pearls. If we can get an aspect of the end crafted, I think we'd be doing pretty well for ourselves. It's gonna be spread. What the hell is that? That was a blaze. I tried making it so it was like a box and I could fight inside a box or something like that, but I just could not. I cannot get this to uh, cooperate. Where is this? This is the guy. Pig 
Pikmin are spawning close to me, so that's all that matters. I only have four. <laughs> oh my god. Only four uh, gold at the moment. Uh, we got some experience though, so let me see here. Where is my enchanting table? Because we might be able to. There it is. Do we have? Did I destroy all my books when I moved everything? I don't see my books. Maybe I didn't have books, so that doesn't really matter too much. Uh, let's just pop, pop it down like right here. Is there anything I can put on here? Chance. Increase the chance the monster dropping its item by. Uh, Requires bookshelf power four. Okay. I can do this. Unless they're my bags, right? There we go. There's the books. Is that all the books I got? I know that was that was hard work to get those books anyway, so let's do here. I don't think I can auto craft bookshelves, but I can apparently. Uh, that's great. So let's turn those into bookshelves. That's seven bookshelves. Uh, yeah, why not? <laughs> well, why not? Let's just put them right here. So they would be in this. Can I put it right there? No, I can't. I can put them right here though, right? Bow and chance. There we go. This will give us a 45% uh, ch chance it'll drop an item. So that that is better. That's a better chance to get loot off these guys. Uh, we should be able to get more experience by killing more of these things. Alright, there is some pigmen. Let's go ahead and get these guys. We got a flaming sword, whatever that is. Hold on. I can't shut the door because of the stupid bow. A flaming sword is a 50 damage, 20 strength item. Uh, that is a nice little item. I don't think it's an upgrade over uh, what we got going on, though. Especially since it's got no enchants, but... Well, there's a lot of pigment out today. Right. Come on, there we go. We got the blaze. Got the pigmen. I see gold nuggets showing up in our uh, bag, so that is nice. Two more gold nuggets. That was close. Uh, let's get rid of this money. We are uh, currently at uh, 3.7 million uh, coins, so the interest we've been collecting all this time has been uh, really nice, actually. So that is, uh, I think we were at 2 million last video. And I don't think I leveled up really anything. The, the gas are probably the worst, uh, the worst mob here. Alright. That guy is like looking at me, want, like, wants to kill me, man. Let's see if we can kill these stupid spiders. Alright, this one. Oh good, he fell off. <laughs> Alright, we're at 18, so if we go to craft, right? And we can make one and two. There we go. So, if we take a look at the recipe for uh, uh, gold, right? Gold minion. Uh, we are going to need <laughs> a 
We're going to need uh, a lot of gold. Uh, wait, do we? We've okay. What? Do we have 70 gold in our sack? What the hell? Hold on. How did we get 70 gold is uh, my question. Am I doing something like completely wrong? Like I don't remember getting 70 gold. Uh, let's see here. Maybe my sacks. All right, 71. Okay, so I guess there is a chance these drop nuggets. I mean, not just nuggets, but uh, the full, a uh, full bar. I. That's the only thing I could think of at this point. I thought they only drop nuggets. All right, that's annoying. Obviously, the the sack uh, does not show you what you looted, so. I hate how these are like instant respawn gas. Alright, we can make a gas minion now. <laughs> uh, I don't know what the benefit of that is. I, I don't even have one on any of my real characters, so... That is uh, some interestingness there. I wish that the, like, the render distance was better, right? So I could actually see these guys. They don't actually break blocks. Come on. I'm burning through so many arrows to do this. I don't know why I can't hit this guy. You've <laughs> reached the maximum number of arrows on your island. What? <laughs> this guy's gonna kill me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, let's look at the sacks now. That was... This is enlightening, right? 78! That's 80. Okay. So, if we do recipe, gold, and then... We just need a wooden pickaxe. Um, we can do that. Craft. One, two. Get some sticks. One, two. All right, that's perfect. Now, craft. No, recipe gold. Gold minion. There we go. And we have our gold minion. All right, and if we craft 15 more, we get another minion slot. So that is fantastic. All right, let's get rid of this uh, another thing. We don't need. We don't need them anymore. <laughs> uh, go back. Go back to the planes. That was crazy. That's it's just it's just it's just crazy. I didn't even realize you could get full. Uh, bars from these guys. I was, I was fully prepared to get uh, everything from. Uh... Oh my god, they're all over here! Oh my gosh! All the pigs are over here. Skeleton right there too. Pigment over here. Turn off the burning. Oh, one more. Nice. We're getting gold nuggets though. That's that's good. Uh, we will need those to make enchanted carrots uh, unless we can get access to the alchemist here, which uh, 
be a pain. Uh, this looks like there's one more right over there. There's a skeleton right there. Took it, took care of him. That fire out, and we're good to go. All right, IS back to the center here. I think we have to like log out to uh, clear the spawn. So let's do that real quick. So let's disconnect, reconnect. And that should clear the island if it changed. <laughs> I have no idea. Just, just a few more over there. We get clearly, clearly spawns up. Got him. I'm glad the pigmen have like very little hit points. Just knock them off the island. It doesn't really matter too much. Nope. I gotta run away from these Endermen. That's gonna be like one of the next goals, I suppose. But uh, we got this done. All right. That's good. <laughs> All right. Let's. Uh, I'll take up a redstone minion to put down uh, the gold minion. I think that'll be a smart what? Why is there mobs spawning over there? There's a torch literally right there. I, d I don't know. All right, which is there? I got five, nine, four, four. All right, you're the one that's gonna go out the door. So we're going to uh, pick you up. Gold one down, we gotta get our pickaxe out. Oh, this gives mining experience, nice. Get all this cleared out. There we go. And he is gonna be a happy little guy uh, now. Unfortunately, uh, we will put this medium storage on him, uh, but unfortunately, the way that the iron and uh, gold, I believe there's one more, they require a different compactor. Now, uh, let's see here, it's dwarven, right? Yeah, they require the dwarven super compactor. Now, this requires mithril. And uh, whatnot. So this is going to be a little, little tricky. So we're going to have to make a super compactor to compact, compact the stuff. But we also need a auto smelter. Uh, looks like we can make one right now. And we don't have enough cobblestone for that. So if we put in the auto smelter, that will auto smelt the ore that it mines. It's got, like, I guess it's got silk touch or something. So it's going to turn the ores into uh, ingots automatically. And if we put a compactor in there, we can go ahead and put this one in there. It'll compact those into blocks. So that'll kind of save us a little bit of time on inventory and stuff like that until we can get a super compactor in there to uh, kind of get it the rest of the way. Let's go ahead and turn that into that. And I'm okay with not having the redstone minion just because... I got a lot of redstone minions out at the moment, so it's kind of going to be too big a deal. All right, so that is that is step one done. <laughs> uh, so that gives us a gold minion. Now let me, let me see if I can pull this in real quick. I'll show you what I'm actually looking at. So this is the stranded map. Everything in red is stuff we've already done. And uh, this was posted on the forums by somebody. Uh, I don't know if there's a credit thing on here. I don't see one. Uh, but credit to that guy. I can't I haven't been able to find the post again. But if you I bet if you search stranded you might find it. And uh this is kind of like the the roadmap of where we're going with all this. So we got gold. Uh, 
Now we can make golden apples to make a uh, emerald trading, right? So we get it. We get a villager. Uh, we get six villagers. We get iron golems. Iron golems give us iron stuff like that. Uh, one of the things we can do here is we can uh, so we can trade saplings of uh, the stuff to get the next tiers of wood and uh, whatnot. We do have flint. I didn't mark that off last time because that was that was a real pain to get. <laughs> so we got that. Uh, let's see here. We got all that knocked out. So I think this is really where we need to go next. I do want to get a cow minion down, so maybe we'll do that real quick. Uh, who do we want to get rid of? To put down a cow minion. I like the cobblestone minions. They're not going anywhere. Uh, the flint minion, you can actually go away. We'll take you up for now. Uh, now, I should, be, I should have a cow minion on me, right? Because we did have a cows before. So we're going to do that. Uh, we need, see, the cow minion, medium storage. I'll throw that stuff in there. And we have a door. I like to put these guys in, like, glass boxes so I can, like, watch them and stuff. So we might have to uh, go get some sand. So let's do that. Warp farm. Or warp garden. Desk. All right, we got a ton of pests. Now... We do not have a sh we don't have uh cactus anymore. That sucks. <laughs> uh that sucks. I don't really want to get rid of any of these cuz uh that was a real pain in to get them all set up. So what do we need to get another plot cuz I want to I want to do that real quick then. Uh so we need 24 compost for that plot. I think they're all 24, right? say that but they're not all right that works so let's do this let's get sidetracked here let's uh throw all this into the center chest here and uh, let's get our advanced toe and yeah, let's throw let's throw those in there all right sacks Look in our sack here, we have 12, so we only need, uh, well, 15, we only need to get it to 24, so that's not too bad. Do we have any seeds on us now? Uh, we have 157 seeds, and there, okay, so let's do that. Oh, we are so slow. <laughs> this is terrible. Uh, but we can do this now, and we can use the super personal compactor. We were uh, we made it early in the episode. Uh, the whole reason for the super compactor was to be able to farm without uh, it being terrible. So do this, get some of this going here. Uh, we need to actually clear all these pests out first. That's going to be a pain. Uh, so let's do this. Let's. Uh, Warp home. I'm gonna buy a booster cookie because I am uh at the way the inflation's working in this game, I'm never gonna be able to buy one. Uh so we're just gonna buy one here. And then uh that'll get us going on bits because we're gonna be doing a lot of stuff there. If we look at where's the bizarre guy, right? They're eleven million, almost twelve million each, right? Like it's it's unrealistic, I think, at this point to uh, consider Getting that so warp garden back to the garden here. All right, so we have we're gonna start. We have the ability to earn bits now, so that's kind of like one of the purposes of that. And we want to be able to get see, this like says 10 bits. We want to buy a god yeah. potion from uh lady here as soon as I can find one of these. We can actually do melon block. Carrot. All right, so they're all up on our list now. Uh, so, okay, there's a there's an easy one. 13 enchanted hay bales. So that's going to be our goal to work towards right now. 
stuff like that. Now, I, I saw a Reddit post, people like watching people grind this game uh, for some reason. So, that's kind of like what these episodes are going to become, is me grinding the game. I'm not going to cut anything out, really. Um, but, uh, we'll see how this goes and uh, whatnot. But I have... I have plenty of time <laughs> to mess with this. I'm, uh... I've made so many videos for all my other, uh, other games I play that I'm kind of, like, burned out on them, I guess. And I just really want to play this game right now, so... Uh, one thing to do is make sure you actually put your farm armor on. I'm not doing this. Gives us a little more speed, too. Uh, I think we can go like this. Get two at a time. The angle is just, like, tricky. But we don't really have the speed to do it. The way I, I just like running up and down the lanes, in all honesty. That's how I love doing it. I think you can get three if you go like this. But we're obviously missing we're missing some of them every once in a while. That's kind of annoying. Uh, but since we have replenish on this hoe, it's really not a big deal. I don't really care if we miss it. It'll just, just grow back, right? We don't have to worry about replanting seeds, we don't have to get too optimal. Here, we're just going to get what we can. This works for getting uh, this. If we can get two at a time, that's uh, eight blocks. I like. I personally just run up and down the rows. I've gotten diamond in every single, every single thing just by running up and down these basic blocks. So it's like you don't have to do too much effort on this stuff. Go Let's see here. Now we do not have an enchanted sack, so I'll we'll donate all the enchanted uh, materials we get for uh, seeds and stuff like that. Uh, once we hit twenty thousand seeds, we'll start getting them in our bag, and then we can use this, the personal compactor to compact those. And then the same with hay. We'll uh, take the uh, the wheat, we'll compact that into hay bales, and then we'll have uh, another one for compacting those into enchanted hay bales. And that should be our three slots. And we'll have to change them around, obviously, because uh, we only have three slots. Eventually, when we unlock the personal compactor 7,000, we should have enough for everything in the garden. To just automatically uh, be compacted as we do this. But I'm surprised we haven't hit 20,000 seeds yet. This is crazy. It's my... Oh, I have negative farming fortune. Oh, yeah. I went to buy... A... <laughs> you can see my mind is totally losing me. Uh, that's why I bought a... Uh, Booster cookie, so I could fly. Get bits. Where'd it go? Just catching these things without flying is terrible. Especially these worms that teleport across the plots. There's the worm. There he is, right over there. I don't know what happens, but sometimes they, like, heal themselves the full. It's so annoying. Alright, we got two in this one. There's one of them. Cricket. We also move a little bit faster when we're flying, so that's very helpful. There we go, we got some carrots. Now, these, these pests are, like, overpowered, in my opinion. Like, they're really annoying, one, but they're kind of overpowered. Like, if you look at some of the stuff we get out of these, like, five enchanted cocoa beans. <laughs> That's enough for me to plant it whenever we, uh, get another plot to plant the, uh, the stuff, right? It's just kind of crazy. Alright, we got three pests in this one. Got our enchanted pumpkins. Oh, there's another one. Four pests. I might... 
You can see we're getting bits, and that's uh, another thing, because if I want to get a, uh, a god potion going, that'll allow us to uh, run super fast, and I can I can play the way I want to play. <laughs> Versus uh, like running sideways and nonsense like that, I don't like doing. Alright, that's all the pests, so let's go back to wheat. And we're uh, going to keep working on... Let's do sacks real quick. If we open these up, it'll tell us, like, if we can craft it in Sky Annie. So it's kind of nice. Alright. I guess we need to run sideways and do sideways on the next one. Oh yeah, and they also added the chocolate factory to... <laughs> To this right and uh i guess we're ready to prestige but you can see here like how far I've, I've just kind of been clicking through it here uh and doing stuff here if we go to the chocolate shop i think i was buying some of this here let's look here sorry i'm all over the all over the page right it's kind of crazy apparently i did not buy i didn't buy the, the I thought I bought the candy bar. I guess not. <laughs> All right, so that means we need to uh, buy that real quick. So if we go in here, Charlie. No, spend. Yeah, I've spent two hundred and fifty million. So I don't know. I don't know. Here, we'll deal with that later. That's. That's a distraction. Could have swore I bought the candy bar, but it's not in my accessory bag, so that's crazy. Just let that keep going, I guess. We're not capped, are we? That's that's where it gets kind of annoying. Uh we can get Max Chocolate, four billion. Oh, no, we're at the max chocolate right now. All right, those are being crushed. Let's fix that. All right. Uh, I guess at that prestige level, we can only have 1.2 billion chocolate. So that's going to be... It's going to be something to figure out. I probably put it in a box. Or it's in my bag. I wish it was easier to, like, search everything. Yeah, I'm getting three. It's not too bad. Let's get rid of some of this junk in our bag so we can actually see things. And I don't see any seeds in there. Alright, we're getting two plots here. Let's do this until we but at everything, every action we do get, earns us bits, apparently. Uh, doing the uh, quest guys gives us like uh, 10 bits per the contest, give you bits. It's pretty cool. It comes to all that stuff, so. Always have a booster cookie going if you can. Uh, and one thing I didn't know, but if you... Which is it? It's right here. So if you look at this thing here, it says bits available 9,000, right? And let's let's say you uh, your booster cookie runs out and you can't earn bits anymore. Apparently it saves up, right? So apparently at one point in time on one of my other uh, profiles, I ate like five or six cookies at once, and I didn't finish I didn't finish getting all the bits during the the time. I, I guess I stopped playing or something, and I came back and I had available bits like I think it was like fifty thousand or some nonsense like that. It took me forever to burn through those, but don't worry about not getting all those bits in a single thing. It's uh, apparently not even necessary. I thought it was when I originally played. Uh, so it's kind of kind of nice. Right. How many? Yeah, I don't think we have enough to make an enchanted bale yet. I don't think we're getting too much. We only have 332 farming portions, so we might try to do one of these con the contest here in four minutes. I think that'll be worth 
doing. Let me see what we got uh, crop-wise here. We got carrots, we got melons, we got pumpkins. We have everything, so... Check my... what's my other tool here? My axe. Yeah, we have an axe, so we're good to go there. We can do any of those. I think potato. We have potato, right? Oh, we don't have potato. Okay, that's that's what we don't. We have carrots, not potato. I uh, will do pumpkin. I think is is this is a smart move? It's like impossible to place in <laughs> melon <laughs> if you don't have a melon dicer three and all that stuff because it gets crazy, but. It's easier to place, I think, in the pumpkins. It'd be easier to place in potato, in all honesty. Uh, but we don't have that set up right now. Go. And we're gonna... We're gonna be putting everything into cactus here in a second, so... Hard uh, just to get the sand from, uh... That... farm plot so we can uh, make glass. Like, <laughs> such a roundabout way to do something, huh? Yeah, I'm so distracted. That's, that's the original goal of what we're doing here. Get the compost. To get the sand. To get the glass. To put down the cow minion. So it looks nice. Okay. That's how my mind works. Totally. Now we're getting seeds. All right, that's perfect. So if we go into our uh, we do slash craft, make enchanted seed. Then we go into our personal compactor, just click on the seed, and see how it automatically did those. Now you can make the argument that you're uh, you know you're losing craft cra uh, carpentry experience uh, by doing it this way, but. There are so, it's just so terribly slow that, uh, you have to, like, stop and craft, like, every row. It's just not worth the effort. But you can see here, we already have 15 enchanted seeds. We're gonna throw all of those into the, uh, composter here. Once we get enough of this, and then I guess we're gonna spend all our money on <laughs> I think the only fuel we can get right now is the uh, 20,000 per biofuel. I wish we could make biofuel. I wish that was like a whole, you know, thing you could do is make it versus uh, half a credit. So we're full on wheat now, so we can do uh, hay bale. So let's go to that. Put the hay bale in there, like I said. There we go. And then now uh, we we'll just wait for now. Now the interesting thing about wheat is it's uh, it's one of the ones that's like compressed more one extra time. So the the final compacted wheat bale is worth you know, I think a million gold coin or something like that because it's just so much wheat in a single one. So it's kind of a kind of interesting the way that one works, but. Uh, uh, after we compress the uh, hay bale into enchanted, it gets one more, which is a tightly bound uh, hay bale or something like that. So we're gonna put the enchanted hay bale on our uh, personal compactor. We'll do the rest ourselves. But since we're at uh, our sacks are full, right? If we look at our sack, we have uh, twenty thousand seeds. Uh, we have 20,000 wheat, and we have 684 uh, hay bales. Each hay bale, each one of these is going to be... Uh... Oh, the contest started. So let's do that. Ah, uh, come on. Desk. Pumpkin. All right. Uh, each one of those is going to be 160 hay bales to make one of those. So... 13 uh, times 160, so whatever that is, we're going to need uh, quite a bit. 
All right, so we're eighteen hundred under bronze. Now, like I don't, I I just want to place bronze, right? I want to get. Uh, I think it's like it's like four bronzes makes a silver, and then four silvers makes gold. We need a gold to make th the to get the the tickets to to buy the uh, the blueprints to buy the like the advanced tools. We we want to get all those, uh, but. <laughs> Like, we, we're not even gonna... It's gonna be hard for us to get the bronze, right? It's gonna take us... It's gonna be 20 minutes of me running up and down here and kill, breaking all these, so... It's gonna be uh, quite a challenge to hit bronze at this low tier 270 uh, pumpkin. So it's just, you know, how, that, how that's gonna work out, but I think we should get bronze by the end of it. Just the way it... The way it works. Um, I think it takes the average or something like that. Typically, like on my on my other profiles, I mess around with putting a little effort into it. I still get bronze on just trying. So, but we're 4,700 behind. So, uh, we're just not generating enough material at the moment. Him. Now we have a pest. Now the pests can be beneficial, like if you, uh, if you get, that's an earthworm, right? So that's a melon. So let's, let's do this. Uh, so melon is the other crop that's going right now. So if we get an enchanted melon block, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll play our melon ranking. will go up pretty high, but we might as well get rid of this guy. Come on. There we have four X enchanted melon, uh, which I don't believe was enough to put us over the thing. So it usually changes depending on uh, what you get out of there. But you're uh, five thousand behind. Not too bad. Not too bad. There we go. Just gotta plop them all right. Four thousand now, so you know stopping to get the pest probably wasn't worth it. But if you get that extra, you know, rare rare drop that they have, it's it's definitely worth it. Thirty-seven. I think we should be able to hit it no problem in the next sixteen minutes. And this is just giving us more materials, I believe. No, 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 no recurrent quests require uh, pumpkins, so that's unfortunate. But uh, pumpkin is used to make rancher boots, so I'll need those anyway. I've been using I've been using rancher boots more on my Iron Man profile to be able to farm. Uh, cocoa beans and stuff like that that have like specific angles you gotta aim it at and all kinds of nonsense speed and angles I hate those kind of crops it's too much effort 24 we're on our way to bronze uh, there's a zero chance we'll get silver <laughs> but uh, one bronze is going to help us get to the next uh, tier we're gonna have to keep doing that uh, like 16 I think it's 16 bronzes to get a gold could be 32 I can't remember go getting some experience though so always worth it there Got walls but I know you can run this at a certain angle like uh, kind of like this I just don't like doing it I always get stuck on something. Like, uh, I don't know what it is, but I get stuck on the like a ghost block or something like that, and it's just annoying. I mean, it's not happening now, obviously, because the game is hates me. <laughs> uh, but you know, you just kind of point it right there at the ground and just 
hit him. I think it's when I'm going faster with like a god pot, right? It makes it a uh, makes the ghost box happen a little bit more often. There we go. But at this lower speed, it's definitely not too bad. Especially, uh, there we go, hit bronze. Now, silver is at 36,000 beyond us, so, uh, you know, almost, what is that, 40-something, 40 47,000, give or take. Um, I don't think we're getting there, but, uh, yeah, we'll just keep uh, doing pumpkins here for the next 13 minutes, and, uh, we'll be good to go. Hopefully we get somebody in the next, uh, in the next pass that wants pumpkins. We can get rid of all these. Now if we needed coin, we could definitely just sell them to an NPC. Uh, in our current, if we did this for an hour, we would make a million, million coin, right? Just barely messing around, we could make a million coin farming these. If not more. Uh, depending on, like, if we had the melon, di melon dicer, pumpkin dicer, and stuff like that. Where you get the, like, random chance. That's kind of, you know, that's something we want to probably get to eventually. There we go. Making, make a good time. This is actually working pretty good. Whenever I do that, whenever I do it, it's fast. I get constant ghost points, but, uh, this is working really nice. And we've uh, finished our plot of pumpkins already. Now we're at 12,000 pumpkins harvested. There we go. We kind of messed that up and broke some of those. Let's fix that real quick before can't fix it. Now that's just because that gap right there. There we go. All right, let's go back to the beginning. Um, don't think there's going to be much respawn, but I don't know what my current garden level is to kind of have a good judge on that. Looks like we're getting some full blocks here, so yeah, there we go. Yeah, there was a ghost block. There we go. Working good. All right, 11 minutes to go. We're at 13,000. We're below. <laughs> Or 40,000 below. Uh, it's just, you know, 53,000 is gonna be impossible for us to hit. So, we just want to stay enough here to, you know, get the pumpkins and stay in bronze for this duration. We might be able to stop. Like, certain points you can just stop and you, you're not gonna lose it. it. Just depends on all the other people, right? So, we're at 49.5%. That is. Probably not a good place to stop. I think silver is like 20%. And I don't know what. I think you have to be in the top 75%, maybe? Top 50% for, for that? For, uh, for bronze? I broke one. they're all like spawn because that makes it easier get these all knocked out that's 16 oh <laughs> it changed it we're at 16,000 I was like what happened over there the little sky block uh, menu changed over on that sidebar I think we need 3,600 bits to buy a god potion, potion, which will be fantastic. It'll allow us to kill things a lot quicker uh, because it'll give us regeneration. And it doesn't wear off when you're offline. So as soon as we can get one of those, I think our combat is going to improve significantly for this early uh, early game stuff. And we can start grinding uh, whatever else we need to, uh, to get going. 
and it'll make it easier to get the, the zombies villagers because we'll we'll be able to heal by just standing still uh, via regeneration so that'll be that'll be soon but so they figuring out how to capture them is gonna be the hardest part I think but once you capture them it's uh, pretty good but uh, if you don't have name tags they despawn so <laughs> it's uh it's all gonna be for naught. We're gonna have to pretty hard to get the zombie villagers and then uh, cure th six of them. Get some iron golems, kill the iron golems, get some iron, um, take that iron, turn it into an iron minion. At that point, I don't care if I have the villagers uh, kind of running around uh, until we get some name tags from, I believe, fishing is where we get those. Unless they changed it, like, I guess I'm just, just what I'm following with here. They, they might have, might have, they don't despawn now? I don't know. I haven't really been following it too close. But anything that's on the island, if you log off, despawns. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's what's going to happen. Alright, we got a full inventory. So let's go ahead and craft this into enchanted pumpkins. Just do these ones manually. I don't want to change my my rules. All right, what do we at here? Twenty one thousand pumpkins. Uh, we are thirty three thousand below silver, so uh, not a whole lot going on there. Uh, we do have seven minutes remaining. I don't think we can get thirty two thousand pumpkins in that time. We might be able to. I'm not really trying too hard here, but <laughs> I just don't think we're going to be able to do it. And our craft is already full, so let's do that, let's do this, let's put that there, let's clear all this out of our bag. So we have more room for pumpkins, yeah, yeah, more pumpkins. Alright, we are still 32,000 below, even though we did stop doing nothing for a few seconds there to uh, move stuff around, so that's good to know. Oh, uh, this is six minutes remaining. There we go. And we might... We might start what we... Like, we need to focus on something, right? I'm like all over the place trying to set everything up uh, but when we start focusing we might focus on the farm first to build up a nice bank egg if you know what I mean like a nice nest egg in the bank so that we are able to buy things <laughs> uh, not that there's much to buy in stranded but you still need you still need money for everything it's uh, just the way it works all right let's get that and uh, I'd like to get to uh, we need to get an ice minion uh, at some point that's going to be a pain uh, requires tr progression through uh, trees uh, because some of the best weapons are the uh, uh, what is it called yeti sword and the glacial staff and all that stuff those are some of the best weapons they all require tons of ice and we need to get that ice working yesterday along with all the other stuff we need going on so I think once we get uh, once all the cobblestone we we need is done uh, that'll be nice to free up all those minion slots but right now it is is kind of an annoying that we have to use so many minion slots on redstone and cobblestone but once they get completely done we are good and we'll have enough enough of the material we shouldn't need it anymore Theoretically, because I, I can't imagine we need more than 30 super compactors and 30, uh, yeah, 30 super compactors. I think anything else we need redstone for, but, uh, should be there soon. All right, we are 22,000, so we were, we've gained 10,000, uh, with four minutes left. 
Let's see how this ends up. Go here. Another pest. Full inventory, of course. Here, let's do this real quick. Because we do have a free slot <laughs> at the moment. There. Now we don't have to think about it. That's, this is the benefit of having the personal compactor. You can see how annoying it is to like stop every row or two to have to like craft that. Now, you know, you give up that carpentry experience, like I said earlier, but it's definitely worth it, in my opinion. Because you can just enchant the enchanted items give way more experience than the uh, thing. So it's like the slow drip versus the big. Uh, the big one, so it just depends. We're getting a ton of enchanted pumpkins. This is crazy. We're at 30,000. We're 19,000 below. This might, uh, this is starting to turn into a competition, I think. We might be able to get into it. Uh, we only have three minutes left, so... I think all the time that I could have just had that... <laughs> uh, that in the, uh, super compactor would probably affected that some, but I honestly didn't think we would get this close. And I don't think we're gonna get it much unless whoever's doing pumpkins literally stops farming pumpkins so that the uh, bar keeps getting raised, stops getting, keep getting raised. At least that's how I feel like the competition works, right? People get bored at the end and they stop. Oh man, we get a lot of pumpkins here. Our price per hour went up too, uh, to uh, 1.3 million. That's crazy. Uh, and that's selling to an NPC, right? So that means we just we're farming fast enough. We're at like 10. Was it 10.12 blocks per second? 10.7 uh, blocks per second. If we can get that up to 20 blocks per second, that would maximize our our. Block breaking, uh, I think you have to like build this in like a staircase kind of system to uh, do that with the pumpkins. There we go, what do we got? 1 minute and 49 seconds left and we are 14,000 away. Not terrible, not great. go, just let this turn away here. Have to get these pests here in a second. I think the cricket is. Can't remember what the crickets are. I thought it was hay, but I'm wrong. I think. I think the flies are sugar cane. All right, one minute left. here 12,000 yeah so uh, maybe next time uh, maybe next time we can uh, actually do it but, uh, not today not today get the rest of these here and this row should be the last row I think I don't know might be able to make it to the front for another row As long as we don't hit any walls along the way. Uh, come on. But uh, yeah, that's my my path forward is uh, getting more comp uh, compost and uh, working on that. But I don't know. I think I might call the video here after we finish this contest. Claim our reward. Just let uh, some passiveness take over for us for a few hours. All right. So we got bronze, which is, uh, you know, not terrible. I mean, uh, and all, all things considered, it's not terrible at all. Go over here to uh, Jacob. We can get our reward. So we have two uncomplete, unclaimed rewards. I guess I did a, uh, <laughs> I did pumpkin before, uh, back in April. So that was the last time I played uh, played farming here. It was April. 
So we got that. Uh, let's claim those. So I gave us 160 bits. Not bad at all. And uh, we got a bunch of enchanted pumpkins. So that's fantastic. Uh, we got those in there. We got a carnival ticket. Uh, that's new. So, so <laughs> whatever that's for. Uh, put that in there. We got some uh, turbo pumpkin uh, nonsense there also. All right. Let's go back to the wheat. Uh, actually, uh, chrono recipe hay. All right, so we made four of those. That's, uh, we need 13. So it's going to take a little while to do that. Uh, but uh, I'm going to take a break here. I'm getting hungry. I haven't had lunch yet. And I think we've uh, kind of unlocked a lot now. I guess uh, let's go back to the, the house, right? Uh, so the goal I, I have, right, is I need to uh, get some glass. So I'm going to work on that uh, offline just because it's kind of boring uh, for me. And I like to walk away a lot. And <laughs> you can't really do that when you're recording. But what we're going to do is we're going to build another glass pen over there. We're going to put a cow in it. And that will uh, start generating us uh, uh, enchanted leather is the goal out of that. We'll take that enchanted leather. That allows us to, along with the uh, spider minion, uh, we'll get enchanted uh, sacks. So we can then make an enchanted uh, garden sack, an enchanted mining sack, um, combat sack, all that stuff. That way we can <laughs> not have uh, this. Like you can see here in my bags, right? I have all this enchanted material and it's just everywhere. It's just a little bit crazy. So that's kind of like one of the goals I have to kind of clear that up. And then I uh, also want to farm bits so we can come over here to the uh, bits shop and we can buy a God potion for next episode. And that'll give us a, uh, that'll be a 1500 bits. We're actually almost there. So we'll have one of those probably next episode. And then uh, anything else we need to get from here? I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm just not sure 100% what else we want. Huh. And then, uh, uh, so the gold minion should uh, have some gold. We should be good there. And then uh, I'll make some golden apples and we'll spend next episode working on trying to get uh, an enchant some, uh, <laughs> some cured zombie uh, villagers to <laughs> trade with. <laughs> Uh, that'll be the goal for next episode, but uh, thank you very much for watching and please have a fantastic day.